Hey everyone, welcome to another pour video. In today's video, I'm using Cama Pigments again, and I'm also using a Desairs Pearlized Green and an Above Ground Magenta. Um, I had to use those two additional colors because I had a really particular color palette in mind, uh, which I'll explain in a minute. It's been a little while since my last video again, uh, sorry about that. Um, after my man cold, I had uh, French exams all week and uh, I really wanted to pass and move on to my next level. So I was all occupied with that. And then I did like this really awful painting and I uh, didn't want to post it. So I had to restretch the canvas and anyways, here we are. Uh, this is the canvas. So after I was all done my exams, I treated myself and I went to this gallery where this artist uh, did these really amazing abstracts and his uh, punctuating colors were this orange and the teal color. And I thought that was really super interesting because uh, a lot of movies utilize that teal and orange color, um, I think to add to the drama or to set the mood. I'm not sure which, but I thought it was really effective in that guy's paintings, so I thought I'd give it a whirl as well, so to speak. So that splash that I just did there um, was actually a super enthusiastic one. Um, it actually, the paint almost went over my plastic wall, which is pretty impressive because that wall is uh, shoulder height. Uh, so, needless to say, I was happy that it stayed in my playpen, and um, I was really happy with the results of the swipe, actually. Um, I got these really awesome cells on there and some uh, really cool webbing. And so I didn't really have any need to have cells in the ribbon that I was about to pour. So I decided to uh, get the variation by doing a whole bunch of tiny little puddles in different colors. Um, and of course, I'm adding the teal there. So um, that was a whole plan behind that. And uh, there was some humming and hawing about what direction I was going to go. But I decided that I wanted to go in the op opposite direction of what the motion was doing. So that's why I did it that way. And I also poured it out backwards as well to try and preserve um, the vibrancy of the color and uh, it actually it preserved it rather well, I think. I was so nervous applying this ribbon because I really liked the splash so much and I really didn't want to mess it up. But I managed to do a good job, so I was pretty pleased with that. And at this point I decided that I wasn't gonna really spin it all that much because right at the end there, there's this like orange and red and teal detail that I really liked a lot and I didn't want to lose it. Um, you tend to lose a lot of detail when you spin it really hard. So I just kind of restrained myself and left it at that. So this is the close up. Uh, you can see that there's a lot of really neat effects going on. Um, I can't believe the cells that, that I'm getting uh, without any silicone. It's just great because it means that there isn't any cleanup when the painting dries. And I think it just kind of adds to the um, overall integrity of it, I guess you could say. And uh, the ribbon that I did was also really cool. I really love the, uh, the fact that there's like that teal kind of uh, stripe all throughout it. I think that it just uh, really is pretty neat, so. Overall, I'm happy with this. Um, it's kind of splashy, but when you get up close and look at the details, I think that um, it's just really neat. So we're getting to my favorite part of the painting, which is the red stripe with the teal little center bit. I'm so glad that I worked really hard to preserve that because it really is my most favorite part of the painting. Um, also, uh, here are the cells that I got uh, from the swipe. I don't know if it's a swipe or a slash. Maybe it's like a combination of them both, but the webbing on it is just is so neat. Um, I couldn't reproduce it if I tried. Um, 
Anyways, that's about it. I hope you liked watching my video. If you did, remember to hit like and make sure that you've subscribed to my channel. Thanks for watching. Bye.